Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. So I hope you guys are doing well and staying safe. Today's video, I'm gonna be sharing with you guys how to build a black girl luxury lifestyle in your 20s. Ooh. So I don't know about you guys, but the whole black girl luxury online has been taking, has been taking the internet by a storm, okay? I love seeing black women living in luxury. Like it's so beautiful and it's so empowering. Obviously everyone has their ideals or on what they deem as luxury um, in today's life and, and whatnot, but I'm definitely en route to living soft life and black girl luxury. Like those two things, yes honey i'm not out here grinding for my life just to not live the luxury life that i know i deserve you know like there's just no way there's no way i'm just going to be doing a girl talk on black girl luxury soft life how we can implement it in our lives while we are in our 20s because most of you guys do know if you watch my videos that i see 20s as a time to build it's the the foundation that you set for the rest of your life and obviously you know it's kind of backwards at the minute where people think your 20s should be a time where you just live it up do up enjoyment 24 7 and then you grow up from 30 40s whatever i think it should be the other way around you build a foundation in your 20s and you do up soft living for all the years subsequently so um yeah before we get started if you are new hey boo how you doing make sure you subscribe down below and you give this video a thumbs up okay and if you are tuning in from the thriving boss hub podcast hey boo boo how y'all doing thank you so much for tuning in okay i appreciate y'all i do i do i do let's get straight into it so the first thing you want to do in order to implement that black girl luxury lifestyle is to define what luxury living means to you what does it look like because everyone is different god made us all differently so in that case what i deem as luxury is not going to be the same thing that jenny over the block thinks is luxury she's going to think something different and that's absolutely fine we have two different types of ideas of what luxury means one thing that helps me a lot and that I've used like I'm a fiend for is Pinterest. I absolutely love Pinterest because Pinterest gives me, it, it allows me to see a visual representation of the luxury lifestyle that I aspire to achieve in my lifetime. So use platforms such as Pinterest or Instagram or TikTok to view different types of luxury that you feel like would work for you and you want to achieve at some point. Yeah, it all starts with you defining what luxury means. So some ideas and things you can brainstorm, what material items is luxury for you? What type of um, relationships is giving that luxurious lifestyle, that soft life? What is your black girl luxury day-to-day -day life looking like? What are you doing in the mornings? What are you doing in the afternoons? What are you doing in the evenings? What type of events are you going to? Are you going to high class events? Are you going every week? Are you going once a month? Are you going, maybe not every day because honey, who has time to go to events every day? What's your etiquette like? Are you using your forks and knives and spoons properly? Because I know I'm not. <laughs> I need to learn how to use like, like dinner table etiquette i need to go to etiquette class that's what i really need to do like visualize all of it what's your friendships like who are you hanging around with what are they achieving in their life what type of relationship have you attracted in that luxury lifestyle what is your partner doing is he providing for you financially how is how is that working what are you doing with your family relationships are you taking care of them how are you looking after them how are you making sure that they're good and they're also living that luxury life with you what's your career saying what are you doing in this luxury life of yours are you working a nine to five are you a manager at your job are you a business owner are you an entrepreneur are you a content creator what are you doing during this soft life era, this black girl luxury era? What are you doing, sis? You gotta brainstorm it and be specific and visualize. Which brings me swiftly onto my next point, which is to set clear goals. In order to get to this 
destination of black girl luxury you have to set goals and you have to achieve them so what things can you do today that will help you get one step closer to living that black girl luxury lifestyle does that mean you need to save more is there a certain amount you need to save every month from your job is there I don't know a bag or an item or something material that you need to get that can allow you to access the starting point of black girl luxury what goals can you create to put you closer towards living that black girl luxury lifestyle remember our 20s right now is to build the foundations and to get us um, started and then each year that we're blessed with from God we then get one step closer as long as we keep working towards our goals number three this is going to be your best friend and that is budgeting you need to learn how to budget your finances properly when you want to achieve that black girl luxury lifestyle in your 20s now i know budgeting and luxury don't really like they don't really go but when you're building it at such a young age you've got to learn how to budget because right now I don't know about you guys whether you're in the US, the UK, you're I don't know in Ghana, Japan, I don't know but right now the temptations of different things to do that cost money is at an all time high. There's events every day, every week, every month, there's concerts, there's, especially in the UK everyone's coming to the UK to perform and that costs money, money. So that's why i say you need to like learn how to budget your money month by month know how much money you get in every month increase your 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 income streams make more money figure out what you're going to do allocate your money accordingly save money aside like put money aside for your future like these are things that you have to take into consideration day in and day out in order to live a soft luxury life in your future. You have to put in the work and you have to sacrifice sometimes like not going to that event or not going on that holiday because you have a bigger goal in mind. So like by you sacrificing for like the next five years, it can change the whole trajectory of your life and put you so much more closer to living a soft life for the rest of your life. So don't you wanna just dedicate what, five years? If you're blessed with five years, you can just use that to like really put your head down, focus, budget, be scrutinize yourself when it comes to money so that after that, you can live freely knowing you put you did everything you needed to do so next up you want to start thinking about different investment options and also just making sure that you have saving goals in mind that you're working towards again with the whole budgeting tip you just have to make sure that you're making your money work for you and you are creating endless of opportunities of receiving income passive income i always say to everyone start content creation like it is the key way and the gateway to success it does take time i'm still in my grinding mode but once it happens once you've achieved that success the amount of money you make is endless so just dedicate some time to grinding creating content but most importantly be consistent with it be disciplined with it show up every single day like do what you have to do that will literally unlock another passive stream of income and you make money like 24 7 every time someone's watching your video the adsense is going up you know find ways to increase your income streams invest some of your money accordingly to help your money work for you so the next section of building that black girl luxury life in your 20s is investing in yourself and first things first we're going to be talking about investing in your education um this doesn't necessarily mean you have to go to university get a degree do this do that no you can literally you can literally invest in yourself simply by purchasing a book and reading it or by listening to podcasts. Investing in your education looks different to everyone. I did get a degree. Do I even remember what was in the degree? <laughs> the business and the business that I learned personally was by having a business, not by studying business. You understand? But it is what it is. But Investing in your knowledge and learning and growing and developing and learning new concepts only puts you at a better position of making more money because you have more knowledge and you're able to build your skills. And when you have unique skill sets, people pay a lot of money for those skills, okay? They will pay you a lot. Invest in your education and your skills. Next up is self-care. You should be implementing self-care whether you want to live a luxury life or not. Self-care is a form of self-love, looking after yourself, both physically 
and mentally spiritually the whole nine as simple as getting your nails done that's like a form of self-care it's a form of luxury because me personally i love getting my nails done during the summertime because you know that's when i'm you know outside here and now pop out a little bit and during the winter i do like to let my nails rest i always get my um pedicure done though they always have to be looking cute and you know doing your hair like got my hair recently relaxed working this little braided ponytail hairstyle form of self-care form of self-love form of, of luxury because i'm looking after myself and i'm making sure that i look good because when i look good i feel even better make sure you're implementing self-care through the season where you're building towards that luxury lifestyle because once you start that habit and implement it week by week month by month year by year when you do actually achieve that numerical success financially speaking then you can really like you can hire people to help you look good and hire people to help you maintain that self-care you know so you start early and then keep it going let that habit be throughout your lifetime so the next tip is networking surrounding yourself with other women or men who are living that luxury lifestyle so that you can get closer to also living that similar lifestyle you want to make sure that the people around you are people that are you know actually going at it and trying to develop a lifestyle that's luxury whatever you want to achieve in life you have to put yourself in environments where you can meet individuals who already have what you have always aspire to be around people who are better than you because it will challenge you and push you to make sure that you develop and grow into the best version of yourself so network with people go to different environments and spaces where you're likely to meet other ambitious individuals whether they have achieved that luxury lifestyle or they're en route to achieving it you guys can work together and you know offer different things that can benefit you both oh and the next kind of section is all about creating experiences i don't know about you but if you type into pinterest black girl luxury most things that come up is like traveling pictures and just like loads of gorgeous black women going on holiday they got a little cute bikini or they're with an elephant they're feeding an elephant in their bikini or you know they got like their mimosas and their breakfast and then their robe and then they got a little towel on their head and they're just drinking their little wine glass like i love it i love it so my tip is to make sure that you implement traveling now again obviously if you are like grinding your hustling you're building the foundations of becoming rich in your 30s 40s whatnot make sure you still go and travel budget traveling like with my tip of budgeting you can still enjoy your life you just have to budget enjoyment do you know what i mean you can't just do up enjoyment without a budget budget enjoyment so you can still enjoy your life budget traveling travel the world don't let your mind be like secluded to just the country you live in go travel wherever you want to go travel you can go with friends you can go by yourself i definitely will be doing one solo holiday next year but just make sure you are safe plan know where you're going be organized in that sense but explore the world that god has created there's so much in this world that like the world has so much to offer so take the offer and travel it create experiences because it will expand your perspective of life and that's always so important so the next way you can build black girl luxury into your life in your 20s is fine dining be a big girl okay fine dining make sure you're going to like an expensive lavish restaurant once in a while okay listen fine dining is amazing like you just go there you dress up you look cute you have your little posh food or you might want to go to like a lounge like a really luxury expensive type of like maybe like a a shisha lounge or something do something where there's just that luxurious feeling budget that in so you can start feeling luxurious now while you're on the way to achieving luxury start now that's what i'm doing like obviously month by month i have a budget i try my best to stick to it have savings goals have all of that whatever but i also like to try and like i've got a little pot that i just say to myself this is my enjoyment money this is my money where i can do as i please i can go out i can go to expensive places i can use some of that money for the uber trip because sometimes if i'm wearing my heels and i got a cute dress on i is not taking the bus i take an uber and i don't have a car right now so i'm not driving myself from a to b yeah just kind of like regularly like 
add in that luxury type like whether it's a solo day or it's with a friend or it's with your partner or it's with your family whomever just add that luxury fine dining vibe into your lifestyle whether it's once a month once every two months quarterly just add it in now while you're young because then you're building up to the luxury life when you grow older you know you can say to myself i've been a luxury bane i finna take myself to, to luxurious restaurants at the youngest age of 18 or 20 or 20 21 25 you see so you want to start now because it's all about building it right we're right now we're in the foundation stages we're just building like a regular routine and once we have that set in stone when we get to five years down the line we've been doing it like we, we're the definition of luxury okay we're the definition of black girl luxury period so a few kind of like spots and like events you can attend that give off that black girl luxury lifestyle while you are in your 20s attending concerts so some of your favorite like musicians you can attend their concerts you could go to art exhibition and you can also go to cultural events explore your city and explore the different things that your city has to offer and really just take advantage of you know different luxury events that you can just pop in and and live that luxury lifestyle okay guys that is it for this video i hope you guys enjoyed if you did make sure you give this video a thumbs up and you subscribe for more content from me and i'll see you guys very soon bye <laughs>